Hello, we are live. We're live at the formerly known as the Cockroach House. Not anymore. Not anymore. Guess what? Guess what? We're done. Yay. All right. So we're going to go in and now see what everything looks like. Let me show you the outside first. Show you how pretty and clean and nice everything is. It's going to make somebody a really nice home. Aha. So there we go. Here we go. Here we go. Nice clean front porch. And we're going to go on to the inside. See what we got. You better unlock it first. <laughs> that would help. Okay. Ready? Bum -ba -da -ba. It's like a whole new place. Yep. Well, you know, minus the uh, garbage bag on the window. <laughs> Everything's clean and shiny. Looking good, looking good. It took us, what, about a month? Three weeks. Three weeks to get all of this together. But now, everything's done. Freshly painted, new ceiling fans. I couldn't help myself. I had to give a, I had to give you all a preview the other day, so some of this may not be new, but everything's cleaned up. Got the new vanity in the bathroom. New, well not new, to, not new tub, but cleaned up tub. Towel bar. Closet's all done. Uh -oh, fan fell over. <laughs> fan fell over. <laughs> this house has so many closets. This is the hall closet. I guess coat closet. It's right off the living room here. And then the kitchen. Kitchen's all cleaned up, shiny, ready to go. Nice clean countertops, clean shiny sink, stoves all clean and ready to go, cabinets all clean and ready to go, close that, doorknobs on, nice clean refrigerator, I don't know if you if you saw this house in the beginning, you would not believe this is the same house. Uh, nice big closet there. This is in the dining room. I just don't know what I'd do with all this closet space. Um, laundry room, huge laundry room. Don't worry, the paint cans won't be there for whoever moves in. Uh, laundry hookups, washer dryer. Uh, and here's the second full bath. New vanity. Let's see the light switches over there. A new, fresh new vanity in there. Mirror. Light. Uh oh, need another light bulb. <laughs> uh, window. Nice new towel bar. This is a big bathroom. Big, big bathroom. Thank you, Cragen. Uh, got any questions? Seems like you're the only one viewing at the moment, Cragen. Um, all right, and then we've got the bedroom with fresh carpet. Nice big closet in here. And big window in here. This bedroom is very big. <clears throat> very very big bedroom brand new carpet love it smells like new carpet it's just awesome here's the second bedroom fresh carpet new ceiling fan clean windows this room is big too these are like 12 by 12 rooms they're just they're huge another big closet in this one what? what to do with all this closet space. It's crazy. 
because then they go way up there too. Just awesome. And then the back door. Uh, let's see here. Out to the side porch. Oh yeah, and, and wait, wait, wait. This is good too. Two closets, two. Right there. Two more closets in the hallway. I mean, you could just store all kinds of stuff. Go nuts. All right. Nice cleaned up porch here. Pressure washed that yesterday. Or was it the day before? No, that was yesterday. And uh, going out to the backyard here. Those cans will all be gone right there. The city, you have to do a special pickup for the city. Those are some oil cans that they left behind. And then their special pickup for the tires too. They've said for three weeks now that they're gonna pick them up, but they didn't tell us until, um, until this past week that you have to take them off the rims. Well, that would have been nice to know a long time ago. And then apparently it was showing in some of their records that it had been picked up. They, they were still sitting here. And I saw somebody, I don't know, somebody's making something up or trying to get out of work or I don't know what they're trying to do. But anyway, it's a pain to get tires taken care of sometimes. Although I have called before and told them, you know, I had two or three tires and uh, just let them know ahead of time. And usually it's not a problem. So I don't know what the problem is this time with, with the tires, except for now we know that they were on the rims. So, okay, so we'll figure out another solution for getting rid of those. <clears throat> but the, um, this stuff here, if you've got toxic chemicals, call the city and they will properly dispose of them. Um, but I'm going to turn it, well, look at, look at this yard. Look how big this yard is. I mean, it's just amazing. You can do all kinds of stuff back here. Big yard, big long driveway. Heck, you could park however many vehicles you got. Four, five, six vehicles back through here. Um, so, yeah, just huge. Nice pressure washed back there. There's some, you know, there's some things on this house that are stained and aren't going away, but that's just the nature of any house, really. Um, but hey, it's a great house. It's beautiful. It's got a nice new roof. It's no leaks or anything. Nice big uh, air conditioner. Um, yeah. So anyway, um, that's your live update. Uh, the uh, the roach house is no more. It's not a roach house. It's a beautiful home, and somebody should enjoy living here very much. Um, it's a it was a pleasure to uh, to do this work. I mean, let me take that back. Not a pleasure to do the work, but a pleasure to have work and to uh, to make people happy. That's that's what we like to do. We're in the service business, and we um, you know we we love what we do. We really do. We love our job. Um, some days are better than others, like any job, but uh, we do love what we do, and uh, we're here to be of service to people, and, uh, hmm, got anything else to add? I didn't hear what you said. Oh, uh, well, I didn't say anything in particular. Uh, I'm, just just, ra I'm rambling. <laughs> well, I can share this. Uh, we will be taking names, uh, putting the names in uh, a paint bucket. Shaking everything up after uh, we get to 5,000, I think it was, on our, yeah. our uh, page. Uh, whatever, and everybody, everybody's name will go in from the first share all the way to the last. Everybody's name's going to go in there. Whoever wins this, you will get a one room painted. Um, or COVID's a little rough right now, so what we... Uh, thought about throwing out there is a uh, free power wash um, sanitize the outside of your house um, if you would like that uh, better um, since this COVID-19 thing's going a little crazy right now um, we'll give away a free power wash clean the outside of your property up wash your patio whatever uh, but like and share uh, we'll build this thing up get it going 
and um, like and share and let us be a service to you. Give us a call anytime, 859-940-7792. Uh, if we can't help you, we know people who can. I just dropped my fitting. Let me go fix this plumbing before it rolls away. <laughs> See you later. All right. I think that's all we've got. Um, there's, I don't know. That's, what can I say? Um, I just hope whoever moves in here appreciates this house and doesn't, uh, you know, it doesn't destroy it and uh, unfortunately there are there are people out there who do that and you know try to leave things better than you found it it's just it's so important and even though it's not your property act as if it is I mean it's somebody's property and they care about it and they put the money into it and in this case they put the money into getting it fixed back up so that somebody could live in a nice home so Take care of it. Um, okay, that's all I got. Uh, if you got any questions or you need our services, give us a call, 859-940-7792. Thanks for standing by. Uh, thanks for listening and paying attention. Thank you. Appreciate your time. Bye-bye.